fix a commit message, easy peasy. That last commit message <sighs> had a typo. You haven't pushed yet. Just right click on the commit, choose edit commit message, and fix the mistake. Now your commit history passes the spell checker. That's how to do it. Let's take a deeper look. This is my development life. I finally wrap up a big pile of work, go to do a commit, and in the rush of victory, make a spelling error, which I spot just as I finish clicking commit. Alas, it's there in the history. We have it pushed, so there's hope. I know, I know, just learn git from the command line. That works for you, but I don't wanna. The good news, our IDEs are really good at this kind of janitorial work. Of course, the best solution is to fix the problem before committing. Our IDEs have a plugin called Grazi, which does, well, let's just call it super cool spelling and grammar checking. It probably warned you about the typo. It will probably even fix the typo for you. Back to our messed up commit message. I could, of course, go to the terminal and type some blah, blah, hurricane, blah, blah, at least to me, commit message. And of course, hope I don't corrupt my repo. This has some downsides. Go to the command line, type something a little obscure, possibly get something wrong and get no help from the spell checker. Fortunately, this is the kind of thing we are great at. Right click on the commit and you'll get a list of actions to take on that commit. There are lots of things we can do to help as this list shows. And beside edit commit message, you can see F2. This shows how we could have skipped the context menu by selecting the commit and pressing F2. We'll select that option and be prompted with a dialog to edit the commit. The existing commit message is there we can see there's a warning about the typo. We mouse over for more detail. This is the Grazi plugin helping us again. We can type to fix it or use Alt Enter to get a correction. Once fixed, click OK to finish the operation. You now see the commit history with the fixed commit message. And that's how easy it is to edit a messed up commit message no repos were harmed in the making of this video. You can read more about this in the IDE help pages, which always seem to have something valuable that you probably missed. And of course, click subscribe. This is a great tip. There are more just like it. And don't forget to visit this tip in the guide where we help you learn your tools, developer to developer. Thanks for watching.